Hey guys, welcome to my channel. This is the Joe Hong Review. So today, I'm going to react to the episode 10 of The Rising of the Shield Hero Season 3. So, there's so many things happening in the previous episode, like defeating the Demon Dragon and uh, getting Philo and Galleon back then. So, yeah, it's a happy ending, but turns out there's episode 10. And it's not like it's the end yet. Uh, there's gonna be like two more episodes. So, yeah. And without any further ado, let's watch this episode. Oh. Hmm. Seems like this guy is uh is full of himself, you know. Like, I mean, I don't have to expect something from the three idiots before coded. Uh, although Ren already uh, redeemed himself, while this guy is still looks like a uh, an asshole, you know. So I doubted that. Mm. But I have a feeling like maybe this time will uh well actually I don't know perfect high justice. <laughs> okay, this is freaking adorable. Seeing Philos trying to uh, argue with a uh, little dragon. Yeah, that is a very serious incident. Oh, wait. The label doesn't come back if you got, or maybe. Oh, are those the shadows from the queen side? Did Did the queen decide this or something? Ah, okay. Oh, Rafu, uh, join in. Hmm. Oh. 
Oh, these two are together. Probably because she's uh, practicing swordsmanship. Oh, I don't know, man. I have a feeling those two are, you know, feeble with each other. Oh, sign. Same sign, man. I don't know exactly how to uh to say her name. I guess sin or sign. All oh, right, did she disappeared? Right, she wasn't there when they're fighting a dragon. So where the heck is she? Oh, she goes back to the Colosseum to fight. Oh. Man, she's really strong. I mean, you can already uh, already guess this from uh, basal weapon holders. Is it Itsugi? Did he join? He joined in the Colosseum? Now it makes sense this episode. I mean, we already finished uh, Ren. This time we're going to see the bow man, the bow hero. Oh, they're going back to the Colosseum now. I have a feeling by this time, Malti, aka Bitch, is already with Itsuki. Considering how she disappeared, so I'm guessing she's here as well. Hopefully we get to see and you know kill her. Girl, I mean I'm not gonna expect now for me gonna kill bitch or anyone. Oh the slave trader. Oh, they're all gonna fight? Wait. Is it okay? Are they strong enough now? I guess they needed to uh, gain experience to level up now. Oh, there it is. Oh, okay. That's uh, super fast. They actually found him already. Uh, man, I just don't feel like, you know, like, how does she still simping for the bow hero? Like, I mean, I think I remember she mentioned something before that Itsuki saved her or something before from season one. He did, she did mention that, but I don't know. I don't know. I just don't know, but she's still uh, 
simping for her, like obsessed to bow hero. I just don't understand. All this time, like, he was very rude to her. Like, I, I mean, we got to see the flashback before as well, how, how they kick her out, but she, she's still insisting on getting to know. Wait, everyone is? What? Are, did all of his party members dead now? Wait, what? Oh! Did he freaking punch her? Oh! Now we got to see another uh, freaking bitch. Uh, she, he's not gonna believe. I don't know. Even though you have an ass. I don't know man i mean this season is all about this uh jerk class heroes redemption or things it's probably gonna be something like in the next episode they're probably gonna redeem bow hero or gonna show us another flashback story of him i i'm guessing it now because i have a feeling it's gonna be like that oh no <laughs> i mean the whole series is all about the rising of the three heroes the redemption arc but still i just don't know how the hell bitch was able to manipulate all these uh three idiots are before you know aside from ren and uh motoyasu becoming you know decent i mean motoyasu is not decent yet he has sick head but still, he's no longer uh, obsessed with bitch. I guess the only left one is Bow Hero, which is Itsuki. Yes, you are wrong. Yeah, that day again. I guess everyone's traumatized from trying to fight the spirit turtles. I mean, that's that's your guy's fault. You rush in without any kind of plan. You know, like strategy to fight. I feel like all those friends of him, uh, I mean, he's friends are a biggest jerk as well did he also yeah did he also uh activated some kind of curse series or something the rage Oh! Oh 
Okay. Mm. You're gonna join. Yeah. You're gonna join. I know what you're gonna say. I mean, some of these scenes are predictable now. Okay, I guess her uh, ironclad's feeling is very strong, you know, she really, uh, yeah, after spending time with Naomi understood about friendship and things, but even now you still wanted to help, it's okay, I guess, so. I mean, Napomi should just let her, I guess. I mean, it won't hurt though. <laughs> I'm pretty sure she's gonna talk some kind of convincing words to Itsuki. Oh, look at all those money he earned. They're gonna be stolen by bitch. <laughs> now I know what's gonna happen. Children you can save. You're gonna slap your freaking face. Let's see, let's see. Is she getting all these ideas like strategy? Is she, is she is she like a genius manipulator or something? I don't know, man. Like it's hard to see though. What are those? Oh, okay, no. I thought it's gonna be like a letter from Bitch again who suddenly disappeared. I have a feeling she will dis get disappeared. You know, throughout this time, and she's probably gonna send like a letter, like I took all those monies to donate or something. Oh man! <laughs> you wanted to earn. By favoring and helping out now for me. Yeah, the curse series. You should be careful. Maybe the same as Eclair. 
Risha will defeat Bow Hero. Perfect high justice. I mean, I'm pretty sure some audience already know that he's a bow hero. Considering that he's the only one who's using bow in this Colosseum. Okay. <laughs> oh man. Okay, so um, this time we got to see the bow hero. Now they, uh, I mean, we already predicted and expected that this this is gonna happen though. Like, bitch, aka Multi, is now with the bow hero, and she also manipulated him by saying some kind of words about slaves, children, or things like that. And then that's why he had to earn lots of money from the Colosseum. And I mean, to be honest, I don't even know that this season is all about redeem, redemption from the um, heroes, the three heroes special. I mean, we didn't get to see uh, Motoya's redemption anyway. I mean, he he's not become this decent, but he became obsessed to Philo. So Motoyasu's uh, case is different. While Ren kinda got his redemption arc in the previous episode, which we got to see and watch as well. And also, that is awesome, you know. I salute to the guy. He, uh, he knows. He knows. Oh, man. Anyway. Uh... Anyway, this episode, uh, we got to see Bow Hero. And I have a feeling like the other friends, which is the party member of the Bow Hero, is also the same as Malti, you know, bitch. I'm pretty sure they are working together to trick him. Or maybe they also been tricked by the child, I, to be honest, I don't even know which one is the bad guys here anymore. I mean, we can say that bitch is the bad guy, of course, but I'm saying that which is uh, like the real. Uh, am I saying it right? No, man, I'm getting confused to be honest in this episode before. <laughs> oh, anyway, this episode getting us nowhere now, but. Probably in the next episode is gonna happen is that the bow hero is going to get defeated by Risha. Risha gonna talk to him like a decent person and have a conversation with him to convince him that bitch is nothing like what he thinks. You know, that he she's a backstabber bitch. So all he had to do is getting lost in the Colosseum and then finding out that all of the money he earns are already gone because Malti is probably on the way out of the city. So I'm just gonna guess that it's gonna happen and who knows anyway. And I mean all I know is that this uh, series is all about the heroes getting redemption. I mean we get to see the few slave people and the uh, rising of the village course and meeting Sadina but throughout the rest of the episode we got to see Motoyasu, Ren and now it's Itsuki so yeah hopefully we got to see a good old fight in the next episode and when are we going to see how bitch deserve what punishment she will get hopefully we get to see that as well so yeah if you like this video subscribe now bye bye